We all know how to work a USB flash drive, correct? You simply plug it into your computer, then you load files onto your drive or copy information to your computer. What you may not know is what makes a USB drive work. So let's take a closer look. Every USB flash drive from your old 16 megabyte drive to your one gigabyte drive to your brand new 32 gigabyte drive is made up of three main parts. The first part is the one you're probably most familiar with, the board. The board holds all of the internal components and includes the USB connector, the most recognizable part of the USB drive. The board transfers power and data to and from the USB. The second component is the memory storage chip. This is where all the files are stored on the USB. The chip is called NAND flash memory, which is why we call them flash drives. The capacity of the storage chip determines the capacity of the drive. Some drives have multiple memory chips for even greater capacity. The controller chip is the third component. The name pretty much says it all as this multitasking circuit controls all of the drive's functions. The controller chip is in charge of retrieving the information from the drive as well as determining how to read and write to the storage chip. Board, storage, and controller. Together, these three parts give you a solid foundation for any working USB drive.